We were uh, very much uh, happy to uh, get involved in the panel today on uh, uh, the green energy transition, which of course took place at a very interesting time, at a very important time. Um, we are looking into uh, a world that is coming out from a series of crises, a pandemic that dislocated the supply chains and, and value chains, and now in 2022, a war that has created uh, a massive energy crisis, including in the gas sector. So I think we highlighted, and I, I had the pleasure of highlighting Morocco's experience in, in that front in winning our energy transition. Of course, we are confirming our uh, 2009 energy strategy that consists of ramping up renewables to more than 52% uh, of our installed capacity based on renewables. So we are on track to reach 52% of renewables in our uh, electricity system before 2030. Uh, we also insisted on the fact of with the need to uh, have uh, energy efficiency being, uh, being involved and so the regulatory reforms that are needed to do so on the supply side and the demand side. Uh, and of course, uh, the, re the question of regional integration is the third pillar of our energy strategy in Morocco. And that's something that we really want to insist on because apart from having a strategic position uh, between Africa, Europe and the Atlantic Basin, we're also interconnected with European markets, gas-wise and electricity-wise and bi-directionally. So it's very important to maintain that stability in our partnership with, uh, with our European partners and uh, with our international partners in, in this time of crisis. We also talked a lot about the role of gas in this transition and I, and I had uh, the privilege of reminding the audience of Morocco's experience in that regard. Um, mind you, in October 2021, we had our own mini uh, gas crisis where we had that we had to, 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 to deal with and we were able to put together an accelerated plan to solve uh, our, our gas issues uh, before the war actually started between uh, Russia and Ukraine. So we were, uh, uh, by putting uh, the right, uh, the, the amount, this, the required amount of, of trust in the system, um, by agreeing with our partners of having certificates of origin of the LNG that we are importing, by making sure that uh, uh, the, the procurers and the, the off-takers are having access to uh, a competitive uh, molecule, despite the volatility, the volatility that we see in the market. And of course, by uh, focusing on, uh, on making sure that we make the best use out of existing infrastructure that we are sharing with our partner countries we ensured we demonstrated that with by by insisting on that triangle that i mentioned ramping up renewables energy efficiency and regional integration and with the, with the right amount of trust and stability of partnerships in, in the system we can definitely win this energy transition even in times of crisis